Welcome back to Phasmophobia. I'm just here to do the weekly challenge. I wasn't on time uh, today because I needed to step away from the computer for a while. I'd spent too much time with it. Uh, but I'm guessing today's weekly challenge is going to be paparazzi. Yep, paranormal, paranormal paparazzi. You've got cameras, lights, and sound. Find that ghost type. Correctly find the ghost type in Bleasdale Farmhouse. Okay, so we go to Bleasdale. Whoops, and there goes the me accidentally flipping myself with the quest. I've adjusted the uh, microphone volume and the game volume. Hopefully the game's a little louder and my voice is a little quieter. Just trying to find some good settings for recording. We've arrived. Check the equipment and get sent up before investigating. Nothing to report, but it looks like whoever was here left in a hurry. Okay, so fuse box is visible. We have both graphs. What do we have? Video cameras, dots, flashlight, UV, ghost writing, spirit box, tier two. Three cameras. We don't have any crucifixes. We don't have any smudges. We don't have any sanity. Uh, motion sensors. What else is missing? Sound sensors. What's normally here? Crucifixes. And EMFs. No EMF and no thermometers. Okay, so we're dealing with a limited equipment set, clearly. We at least have... No, we just have tier one headgear. Well, wait a minute, no, it's tier two headgear. Could serve as a flashlight, but it's not a very good one, so I'm going to use these. Uh, guess? Come on. Let me grab you. <laughs> Uh, I'm going to make sure my audio is good. Yep. All right. So I'm hoping that we have three evidence. Um, I can't conclude. Oh, sunrise. Perfect. Uh, I was hoping to look at this with my quest. So yeah, there is a little bit of banding, but it certainly isn't bad. But I recall looking up at this with my quest 2, and it, there were a lot of real serious separations in color. Maybe they just improved the texture. I don't know. Alright, let's see if I can find the ghost. Let's see what we can figure out. I don't really... I guess I could look for a cursed object, for whatever it's worth. No monk... no tarot cards. No cursed mirror. No music box. And I flip myself around again. No tarot cards. The quest controller is really sensitive when it comes to flipping myself around. I need to be careful about how I do that. I think the Ouija board would be here, but we don't have it. So I'm dealing with limited sanity. Did I just hear something up there? How old are you? Where are you? What do you want? How old are you? I wonder if it's in here. Don't see anything out of place. On the bone. How old are you? 
Where are you? How old are you? Where are you? What do you want? Guessing it's not spirit box. Dang, it's just knocking on the doors. So let's get a UV light and see if it's fingerprints. Why is it? It really, seems really pixelated. I turned my sampling down to 2100 earlier. At least I think I did. Doesn't seem to be a UV ghost. to make of this. I mean, if I don't get any evidence, then the only evidence it could possibly be would be uh, the evidence that I can't collect. Freezing, EMF, and something else. Uh, well, at least I have motion sensors. So maybe I can at least figure out where the ghost is hanging out. Okay, so you're in the bedroom. Good. That's helpful. How's my sanity, by the way? 89. <laughs> hit a window. Check again. Don't see anything. Thank you. seems more pixelated than uh, it usually is. That's from the ghost event. I can still detect EMF with... Okay, we got ghost storm. I can still detect an EMF with the uh, truck graph, if necessary. It's not spirit box. Is that a ghost? Certainly looks like it. So we got dots too. Banshee, Yuri, Raiju, Thay. Hmm. 
It's not ultraviolet. I have no idea if it's freezing temps, and I won't know because even if I see my frost breath, there's no way to tell. So it's going to be a Yuri, a Raiju, or a Thay. Hmm. I need an electronic. I need to provoke a hunt. Do we have a cursed object anywhere? I'm going to put this at the bottom of the steps. That way if it's a Raiju, I can hear it when it's fast. No photo doll. Summoning circle? What would an appropriate cursed object be for paparazzi? I drop. I thought I dropped. Did it throw the book? I thought I dropped a book in here. It's probably not a Raiju or a Year or a Thay, or would have hunted by now. Off the power. But if it's a urine, it was closing doors when I was in an adjacent room. That would have caused sanity loss, but my sanity is fine. Hmm. I already know it's a dots ghost and ghost orb. I don't know what the third evidence is. It's probably not EMF five, which means it's a Ure or a Thay. Which evidence would I be looking for? Ghost writing for a Thay? If only I had a way to reduce my sanity. Monkey paw would be here, wouldn't it? Or no, I think the tarot cards would be here. So where would the monkey paw be? All right, let's find out. I wish to see the ghost.
Okay, so it's gotta be a thing. Because it's fast everywhere. I could barely hear it. I forgot I forgot wishing to see the ghost uh, causes you to be kind of deaf and blind for the duration of the uh, resulting hunt. Yep. Welcome back. I've prepared some jobs for you. Okay, that's one. The nice thing about the weekly challenge is you can die and still get the ghost correct. Fog where we now. In the world? Huh. I thought they fixed the fog. Weird. Oh, interesting. Maybe it's something with a quest 3. I have no idea. Just heard something get tossed. Oh, there we go. How old are you? Where are you? What do you want? When a young sailor. Okay, we have spirit box. Um, maybe what's also what's happening with the, f uh, the fog is, um, I remember something going wrong with the fog when you die. Uh, maybe that's related. Okay, so we have spirit box. Get all the other fixings in there. Anything else? Oh, no salt either. Hmm. Guess I can look for fingerprints. Sanity is at 97. No. There. I know that when you're dead, you get a fog environment that you're walking around in. Maybe, maybe uh, when you die, it just fails to reset the environment properly. Okay, so it doesn't look like that ghost orb is the thing. Whoops. What else? Plenty of EFM units going off. And we have another Death Ghost. That helps. Wraith, Phantom, or Diogen? Mm hmm. And me without a way to reduce my sanity. Wraith or Phantom? Okay. Oh, monkey paw. Okay, okay. I know that... I can use the monkey paw to ask to see the ghost, and I can click a picture of it, and if it disappears, I know that it's a phantom.
And if it runs fast to me and slows down, I know it's a deep gen. So let's grab the monkey paw. I wish for sanity. Instead of wishing to see the ghost, I'll just wish for low sanity and provoke a hunt. Also, wishing for sanity causes the ghost to change rooms. Yeah, this is an anno annoying bug, isn't it? all the way up to the attic. All right, fine. I wish for sunrise. If that's not low enough, I don't know what is. Sanity's low enough. Do something. It's a phantom, a wraith, or a diogen. Hey there. That was it? Are they short hunts or something? Diogen. 
20. Yeah, it looks like it hunts for 25 seconds, so it's a medium hunt. Check the setup timer. Two minutes. Okay, so I'm an intermediate. I didn't realize that. I've got nothing else to report, unfortunately. Let's see how quickly I can find the power. Cool. Now let's see how I can use the monkey paw to help me out. Well, I mean, I should locate the ghost's room first. I'm not hearing anything. So is this the ghost room or is this the ghost room? How old are you? Where are you? How old are you? What do you want? How old are you? Where are you? What do you want? I'd say it's pretty likely this is the ghost room since it's so cold in here. Now I could have used the monkey paw to say I wish the ghost was trapped and it's very likely that that door was slammed shut. But if the ghost was a hallway ghost, then all of the doors in the hallway would have slammed shut. Well, I think it, I think it locks the ghost wherever it's standing, not where its favorite room is. And I've never used that wish. At least I don't remember using it. Um, tell you what, I got room. Let's. Take a UV flashlight up. Seeming like it's a UV ghost. Monkey paw. Oh. Don't suppose you want to give me a dots pattern. Yeah, I need to up the resolution. I don't enjoy it being this pixelated. Okay, we have a ghost orb. You want to give me dots again? I think it just did. Pinchy, Yuri, Raiji, Rathay. Yeah, 
Banshee, Yurei, Raiju, or Thay. How about test to see if it is a Banshee to see if it comes to wander to me. Peep on me? Yep. I'd say we're dealing with a banshee. I'd say that's pretty definitive. Is there anything I want to do with the monkey paw before I go? Crucifix and incense. Nope, can't get those. Alright, well I'm just going to go with Banshee and get out of here. It wandered to me and it left me a fingerprint. Works for me. I got two achievements? I can't see them, so I don't know what they are. Guess I'll find out later. Alright. And that will put me at level 92. And that took me six minutes. Alright, so yeah, not too hard of a challenge. It's kind of annoying that uh, we don't have decent equipment. But um, it's similar to a lot of the other challenges that have, give you a limited set of equipment. You just go with what you can and uh, eliminate what you can't uh, collect if, you, if you're if you suspecting that. Um, if you can eliminate enough of what you can collect, it can give you some really strong clues about what the ghost will be because it, they do, it does offer three evidence. So if you can prove that it's not a spirit box, you can cross it out and that will limit your ghost list, etc. So good luck with that challenge. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next video.